what? All that fucking hurt. All that fucking pain. That shit fucking hurt. And I had to deal with it alone. A decade alone. I had no boyfriend to protect me. He was the one hurting me. Then, what happens when I finally fucking give up? You know what? I need my fucking space. I need to clear my head. I give the fuck up. Because you know what? We move into atrium. You're still pushing me away. You're still pushing me away. My birthday came. You're still pushing me away. 29, you're still fucking pushing me away. pushed away my whole life and you think I was going to sit here and after Brandy opened up my fucking heart 100% I don't care if she was a freaking oh I just made her up to make you jealous and I found out about you I don't care I don't care if she was real I don't care if she was make believe you know what <laughs> the fucking thing is if I didn't feel like you pushed me away I would have never left I thought you were actually helping me and wanting to show that you actually care about me and that I could actually trust you and that I did not have to be scared to open up my heart to you. Especially being hurt and having to rely on solely you alone. Because it was only you. And you knew this. Only you. I don't do shit unless I'm forced to. And that's in any damn thing I do. I'm not upset. It's exactly what I told you before. I'm just disappointed. Because it's like right when my heart fucking unfolded for you started to open back up towards you again in the summertime your sister your family and you all piled up on me all at once and i'm just so happy that the fucking flutters that i actually started feeling in my chest for you again just decided to say oh wait bitch nope he's not he doesn't mean that shit he never meant it <laughs> 